All right, stupids, let me make this absolutely clear. You all can miss my channel with you all's racist gaslighting. Listen, if we're not going to call everybody to the table, miss me with the foolery. I mean everybody, including Wolf, including Storm, including Zolo, including Blabbermouth, including a lot of you all people out here. If everybody's not coming to the table, miss me with the foolery because I stand on my words and it's documented all over my channel how I feel about it. Now, listen, uh -uh. I'm out here doing commentary not to point out who is racist because you stupid people indulge in it and you all enjoy it until it hits you all. Absolutely, uh-uh, Wolf would be more than willing to sit at the round table and have a conversation with you all about the terminology that he uses out here. Listen, uh-uh, uh-uh, you all are the ones that will not come to the table because you all want to gaslight the situation. Now, carry on, carry on. And listen, 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 listen. I'm like, wow. YouTube is serious. Better leave me alone, you old head. Anyway. I can love an enemy. I'm in my face, but that is not afraid of me. Amazingly hilarious out here, but I must give this statement to the new people thinking they are going to enter this sector and absolutely accomplish something. It's a no go. Absolutely no room for you all and you all's content because I don't see any content over there. So there's nothing for you to do over here. So Zolo, pack your bag and go on with your new crew. Now let's get into this video. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Listen, there's some foolery stirring around out here in the atmosphere. Listen, what will be the aftermath? All of the rottery rah rah. <laughs> Y'all are absolutely hilarious. Let's get into it. You all, if you haven't caught Slick's live from last night, it was absolutely epic. Listen, what? Y'all know, okay, let me try to explain to you all, people. Now, you have this guy who was out there selling the YouTube red notification buttons. He clicked onto a live, and it happened to be Storm. So he sell from Storm Channel to Blabbermouth Channel, to Zolo's channel. Absolutely, that's the cruise, the voyage he went upon. He collected information. He said, oh, they have something going. Let me go check these people out. They are considered to be beefing with. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, that's what he did. So he sailed on over to the We Are The Clout channel. And let's say he jumped on. He wanted to orchestrate some type of Royal Rumble over there on his channel. Listen, he was absolutely out here scavenging for subscribers and views he was that's what youtube is about nothing wrong with it so he has this big royal rumble on his channel and listen only we the clout came through wait a minute let me rephrase that storm got up there and said listen i don't have nothing to do with this foolery going on with zolo this is about me and jenny and me and jenny only y'all move out the way and miss me Blabbermouth also got up there and said, blah, 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 blah. I'm not dropping nothing, blah, 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 because I don't have any receipts to give. Uh-huh, that's what she said. Now, listen, it turned into a surviving Zolo band. Absolutely, it did. <laughs> Zolo has made so many enemies out here on this YouTube streets, but listen. Zolo absolutely feels he has a comeback. Zolo feels, oh, Wolf and Cam got into it last night. That was the explosion over there on Slick and them channel. Y'all have to go catch it. Now, let's see. Cam and all of his crew decided to pop up over there thinking they was going to bring some ruckus. All they brought was watch hours and views. Absolutely. This side is thankful for the return of the favor. That's it. We want 
they want, I hope they don't want any more to do with you all because you all are non-beneficial. Let's say they sent their troll over here. Cam said he put somebody over here to check the channels out. She was absolutely non-beneficial. I'm not going to call a lady a troll, but she's not beneficial because she reported back nothing of credibility because they still have this assumption that this is some type of beef in sector. Listen, there is a sector called the beef sector, but this sector just happens to be a reaction sector off of three moms and now these break off channels. That's it. Nothing more, nothing less. Zolo is catching the blows that he is catching because of him. That's it. Ain't no beef going on over here. It is content going on over here. <laughs> Listen, these people need you all. It's nothing we, this sector, as small as, as it is, need from them people over there. It's nothing possibly they can do for this sector. Absolutely, it's not. Listen, now Zolo is so hyped because Cam is going at the Wolf. Listen, it looked like that was the game plan from the beginning because Wolf didn't stand a chance. Listen, once everybody, what? Once Zolo squad told them and put word in their ear that Wolf used certain terminologies out here on the YouTube streets, they were gunning for Wolf. Listen, because... Cam Spider, he put out here to bring him back information, and she really couldn't help him because she led him wrong. She led him wrong about this sector. Absolutely, she did. But anyway, her first response was, yo, Wolf, where your receipts at? You said you had such and such on Zolo. We want to see receipts. I'm like, wait a minute, wait a minute. You're confused. Wolf never told you he came up with any allegation. These allegations have been ran through the YouTube streets for a minute, okay? So it's like you're asking him for receipts. He's not the original sayer of these things. He was just trying to inform you on what was going on down here with Zolo since you was interested in insecticide. See, that's how you know they already had their own thought process formed because um, why was she asking Wolf to give her receipts? Listen, uh-uh, why? I, I watched her from platform to platform to platform because she was new and I wanted to know who she was. Listen, where's my job over here? Y'all are absolutely foolish. Now listen, Room Shaker, I absolutely like her. She reminds me of my best friend. Listen, she can be one of the sweetest people in the world, but get her wrong and listen, we pull it all nighters and it's just like, listen, calm down, calm down. Woo, child, but anyway, you are going over there. Zolo wants to lead you all over there to have some type of royal rumble between Zolo and Cam. Absolutely not. We gave them views. They are non-beneficial. They're not wanted over here. Zolo needs them. So Zolo should take his branch off channel. And absolutely go include himself in that sector and become part of the foolery going on over there because it's absolutely not wanted over here. Now, let's jump into this stupidity going on out here with the specimen Jenny with the specimen and Storm. Listen, Storm is absolutely seeing red, and I couldn't understand at first. But wait a minute, when I got with or word of Jenny putting Storm's son out here on the internet, I absolutely got where Storm was coming from. Listen, would I make moves the way Storm is making moves? Absolutely, I would not. I would sit here and continue to make Jenny my content. All of the information I put out here, I will put it on my channel and make dollars off of it. I would not make a mockery out of myself arguing with something such as that specimen. She's content. She is a dollar. What more do y'all want me to say? That's why she's content here. Don't you all get paid off of the three moms? Well, I'm going to get paid off of this worthless mom also. So that's where Storm is kind of getting distorted at. Stop going out here in these YouTube streets beefing with your content. It makes absolutely, it makes absolutely no sense, Storm. Uh-uh. Do your commentary on her. Do your reactions on her. Do your parables, cerebrals, whatever you say you over there doing 
on her and call it a day. Don't come out here giving her the limelight. Uh -uh. Only on your channel store. Only doing your content. The rest of it, it ain't worth it. It ain't worth it. Now, everybody is out here wanting to say Storm is a liar. Jenny is telling the truth. Absolutely, who cares? Because let's say Jenny is absolutely leading y'all astray. Listen, just because Jenny could go gather up some false document, some old, outdated documentation means absolutely nothing. Let's say where is the court agreement stating that the children live with you, that they're in your custody, not that you petitioned the court. Because what is so mind-boggling to me about these kidnapped kids is, listen, when they rescued one of the kidnapped kids, they found out that she had been assaulted in numerous ways by a man in that household, okay? And the other two kids were still with the kidnappers getting ready to go on the run. So you all mean to tell me no authorities killed, cared about none of this? None of this they wanted to look into. They did not snatch them kids from them kidnappers and arrest that man until he was, I, I mean, let, let's say. So it, it's this going back and forth. Jenny has her kids. Jenny does not have her kids. If you all have common sense and you all listen to her stories, when could she have possibly had them young children in her care. Not even a year ago, a care was taken from her for having a gun to her head, marijuana in her system, cocaine in her system, a STD. So you all don't think the other kids would have been removed from that house and put into DSF department with whoever care? Like, listen, shut up. Continue on with the stupidity. Now, 